Well, dang, it's been a while. Super Bowl Gamers Game Show, welcome back to Ron. It has been almost about nine months since we last played this, and I want to play this again. So I'm start from the beginning. Great, I can't use the arrow key. Oh, gosh. This is a really bad start to an episode. Alright. Why mess around with Stripe? I want it to be as simple as can be. Just give me potatoes. Live in the simple life. Let's do this. Alright, here we go. This is very simple. I, I'm glad. If you want to see the other sequels and Run 4 when it comes out, let, you gotta let me know about Run 4. I, I'm not gonna know. Oh! I'm not gonna know about Run 4, guys. It's not my job to keep up with these things. Uh. It's not my job to keep up with these things. I'm sorry. Um. Here we go. Boom. Let's try the next one. I'm sorry I can't make the screen bigger. I'm very sorry. It's the best I can. I'll leave the link in the description so y'all can play this yourselves. And it's free. It's, you don't even need to download it. It's just here in crazygames.com. And actually, there are a few cool games. There's Paper Minecraft, which is very cool. And if you don't have Minecraft, just play it. Oh my god. Just play the paper version. And I do have to announce, Geometry Dash will be taking a break. Probably a long break. Probably about a year or so. I don't know. It's just, I don't want to upload Geometry Dash videos, because I've uploaded already six of those. Which may not seem a lot, because of the fact I uploaded almost 13 episodes of of Happy Wheels, which isn't a lot, but I do want to make a bunch of episodes on Happy Wheels, as well as, uh, well, I wanted to do an Elder Scrolls gameplay of Elder Scrolls V Skyrim, which would be really cool, I just gotta, gotta get the stuff for it. I want to do a GTA V gameplay like I did all the way back in, like, July, I think, y'all can go check it out, I don't know, if y'all can leave a comment and tell me when I did it, I, I would be appreciated by that. Also, I've noticed that my channel viewing is not going as high as I thought it would be. I'm not here for the views or the money. I'm just here to have fun, get a chance to get on, and just play some games, you know? It's fun. And actually, I'm doing a lot more gaming because what I realized, how many videos I did last year were mostly all music video type stuff. So, I wanted to take a break from those kinds of videos and go and do some gaming because my YouTube name is Gaming with Sean. Haha, <laughs> very funny. I if I'm gaming with Sean, why do I play a bunch of music rather than games on this channel? Bro, I play what I want to play on this channel. I play what I want. Now, Run I just wanted to play because I played it in the past and it didn't come out very well. I loved playing Run in the past. And, you know, this is just one of those games that I played in 5th grade and I'm like, you know what, we have to do a gameplay on this and return to it. So this will literally be Run Episode 2. And I didn't actually originally have this for the schedules of the games that I wanted to play. I did not want to play this game originally. When I had made the first three episodes for all the first the for the for the first game and its sequel, I was like, you know what, I don't wanna I don't wanna return to this game because of the way it came out, but now I went to check the views and actually they got some good positive reviews. Well episode one did. The other sequels didn't, so I might not play the other sequels, but I might if I'm lucky, I'll play the other sequels. But Run 4 I'll definitely be playing when it comes out, just, you know, so I can fit in the timeline, you know, fit in, uh, the games. You know, Run is a game that I didn't even expect was going to be on this channel again, because honestly I thought, well, I had done the first episode, so I'm like, what's the point of returning to it again? And I realized, you know what, I should just return to this game, so I decided, you know what, just skip it, we're going to return to the game, and here we are, playing Run on, on this channel. It's very fun, I must admit. I love playing Run on my channel. Shout out to Elizabeth's channel, too. You gotta give my family the props, too. I mean, allow me to do all this. I mean, you know, thanks for Elizabeth giving me that shout out in May of last year. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Now, this is a very fun game. Ooh, this is a light level. This hurts my eyes. Oh my god! You could take this as a replacement for Geometry Dash for right now, and I'll play some Scratch games, because there is a cool Scratch game I want to play. There are some cool games on Scratch that I will play. 
but this game was one of the highly recommended games I had played. And I'll be making a poll on Facebook so y'all can choose games on my YouTube for the YouTube channel and see what games y'all want. Because I don't, I want to know what games and series you want to still continue and series you want me to put to rest completely and make the finale of. Guitar Vid? I'm not going to probably do a finale at any point soon. I mean, yeah, it's been a long time since I did an official Guitar Vid. Like, Guitar Vid Episode 2 is, I think, my favorite Guitar Vid I ever did, besides Part 3. Other Guitar Vids I didn't do as well. Part 1, it was good, but it didn't get received well by critics or views and anything, so I just decided it, I'd take a while before I made the sequel, and of course in May, y'all got your wish for the sequel. Because I wanted to see, I, I told y'all I had gotten a new guitar, and I showed it on camera, and then we're like, make a video with it. So I I, I didn't want to continue the Guitar Vid series originally. Um, I, I, I wasn't even supposed to. I was just going to leave it as its own thing. You know, to see what I had at the first time I ever played guitar, but now the series actually expanded on a bunch of sequels to it. Now, let's talk about my Happy Wheel series. One of the most popular series on the channel of all time. Which is one of, hands down, my favorite games I've played on this channel. The hands down, Happy Wheels has been the best one. I've never played a game better than Happy Wheels on my channel. And I don't think that I don't want to take a break from Happy Wheels. Of course, after Part 11 came out, it did feel like, after all seven months of waiting for the next episode, it did feel like I was leaving the series and not going to do any more episodes. Not sure, I did want to make more after that. Just I, I, I literally had no idea how I was supposed to come back until Easter. I thought, that's the perfect time to come back. And I'm coming back for Happy Wheels during all seasons, actually. My birthday, I haven't decided what we're going to do on this channel. I'm probably just going to live stream my birthday live. We're just going to have some fun. Play a bunch of random games, you know. We can play a bunch of games live in front of the whole world. Of 15 satellites, you know what I mean? That Bohemian rap, Bohemian Rhapsody reference, you know what I mean? 15 satellites at Wembley. Oh. Now let's talk about the horror series that scares me the crap the most. And I still want to play, but I sadly won't probably be able to play on this channel ever again, or anytime soon. It's Night Blights. Night Blights was a series I started in, er in late January. It was my first gameplay I had done on YouTube in about three months, which three months for no gameplays were insane. I just did vlogs. I didn't do anything. So I decided I just went on Game Jolt, found some random stuff. And I was, I was looking at horror games, I found the game called Nightblights, and it looked pretty cool, so I was like, I'll download it. And little did I know, Markiplier and Corey Kenshin, and Jacksepticeye, I think, both played that game, and I'm like, wow. And when I first played it, it got almost 28 views, I think, on its first day of release, which is a lot for a video. Now, you know, today we're getting 100 views, like, pretty much every day, but... Back at that time, I had just got out of the hospital. I wasn't really good at doing YouTube after that. Because, I mean, I still knew how to record and upload. Just I couldn't upload it at the time because of how weak I was. You know, I was supposed to be recovering. I'm not playing freaking games while I'm trying to recover. I wouldn't do it, and I never did. So I took a break from doing that. And I came back in January, finished off my first record, because... You already know the bait, the, wait, what was it called? Well, I need your bass, something like that. I don't know, but it was the final track on the first album that didn't come out until after I got out of the hospital. Because I had just released, was it I Love You or Hey Hey Hey? Someone tell me that. It was one of those two songs that I had just released. The day before I got my appendicitis notification, I was like, oh dear, this is not going to, how is this going to affect my channel? And I hadn't uploaded anything, but KO happily uploaded something for me. So, KO, if you're watching this, I thank you. You're in my heart. Um, I really appreciate everyone, by the way, all you guys being patient and letting me take a break while I was in the hospital. I really love that all of you were there helping me. All of y'all. Just want to say a few guys and names in here. I want to say thank you first of all to Cat Morrison. Thank you very much for your support and helping me get through. I your friendship and your 
your beautiful faith helped me through it, and I really appreciate it. And believe me, I'm glad you helped me. Um, Ko, you, you're one of the big names. I really want to thank you for getting a video out when I couldn't. It, it's your, it's you that really got me out of here. And I just want to say thank you. It's all you, bro. And my dedication will go all to you. Now, Tasha and your family, you guys, thank you so much for stopping by to see me. I, I missed y'all when I was in there, and luckily I got a good visit, and of course, I was not weak. I was, I was weak. It was... But the biggest shout-out I could give is to my parents. Well, my mom, big time, because she was the one who sat there, stayed by my side. Thank you very much, and I really will hold you dear in my heart. And I... Honestly, when I got appendicitis, it really hurt, and it it wasn't until two days after I was recovering that I got announced with my blood clot, which, believe me, annoyed the crap out of me. And boom! All right, so um, I want to just say that we still have a few more levels to go. I know we do. All right, well. That was Ron, so I'll see you in the next gameplay. Bye, guys.